Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to generate any trees for your Blender 3.6 just by using the Trees Generator add-ons for Blender 3.6. So start from now, I'm going to show you step by step. Just have a look. Now I already generated a cherry blossom. And the first step, what you are going to do is just go to my video description. Go and get the plugin, the Tree Generator add-on the tree generator plugin for Blender. Once you click into the first link in my video description, it is going to lead you to lead you to here, the tree generator. How to download, you can just move your mouse cursor to here, then download the zip folder. Download the zip folder and no need to extract it. So the next step, I'm going to show you how to install the, the add-on. First, you have to go to the edit preferences and then go to the locations, click the add-ons, click install, choose from the location where you download the zip folder. This one, I put it on my desktop, so I choose from my desktop, it is a zip folder, the tree generation, the, the tree generator master. Just double click it, it is going to install the add-on, then here you search tree, then you should be able to see a tree generator. You have to make sure you tick it to select it then it is going to activate the add-on then in your blender as demo the first step i'm going to press a and delete everything then press n the tree generator will be here then first you can choose the tree that you want there are so many types of the trees here it is 20 types of the trees once you already choose it let's say if you want to have a sphere tree then choose it and load the tree parameter generate the tree then just wait for a while it is going to generate a tree like this right of course this one you can just rename this as sphere tree i'm going to generate more i click and then i turn on the texture right, i click and press g and press Y and I move it to somewhere else. I'm going to create one more tree. Let's say the apple tree. Then I click generate the tree. It is going to generate one at here. Sorry. So now it is not an apple tree just because of I not yet load the tree parameter. So I press delete to delete it first. Control Z here. Just delete it first. Once you choose the apple tree, you have to click load tree parameter, then click generate. Now, it is going to generate an apple tree. The next step, I'm going to show you how to create the texture. So I click here. I, I want to create the material. First, I'm going to click on the leaf. Then, I go to here, just add a new material. Choose from the base color, like this. And for some other leaf, I click plus new and then choose a color as well so that it can make realistic then the branches also click plus new change the color of the branches like this you can adjust the color by use your own customizations it is really easy now just have a look there still have more branches. You have to add the colors as well. Done. Done. Now let's have a look. This is this is a tree. Then here you have one more. First from the leaves, you change the color. Click and just plus new. You can adjust the darkness that next is the branches. Make sure you click the branches. Then add the color as well. Just add it one by one. here the trunk 
right, done. Now you can see I already generated two, two of the trees. One is the apple trees. This is the apple tree. And of course you can duplicate it. Just duplicate everything like this. So I click the first one, hold the shift, click the last one. Control C and Control V. Then I press G to move it. Then I press X so that it, it is going to duplicate along the X axis. Now I already have two apple trees. It is really easy to generate. There are 20 types of the trees you can generate it. And now you can see there are just six in my display pictures. And you can just explore it. This is a free add-on. You can just go to the official site to go and download it and generate, generate trees for a blender. It is really easy. All right. That's all for today about how to generate the trees by using the tree generators add-ons for your Blender 3.6. And that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my videos, tutorials, and sharing, if you feel all these tutorials and sharings are very helpful to your 3D modeling, 3D animation, and 3D game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new video, tutorials, or sharing, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy happy 3D modeling, 3D animation, and 3D game developing. See you.